if you are tired of people, so just go into, into the bookshop. It's completely empty and you are alone. At last, alone. Of course, I'm joking, it's not true. Thank you, André, for answering my questions today. Will you write another book about Geraint? What can I say to the fans? Yes. Yes, there will be a new book. Oh, when? I cannot tell you because uh, when I put the potatoes into the water and on my stove, I can tell you in 20 minutes the potatoes will be ready. But uh, as far as the book is concerned, no, no one can tell. I consider the, um, the five tome, let's say, cycle or saga, like people use to say, as a closed story. So it was absolutely sure for me that uh, I will not ever write anything that happened later. So there so will be no continuation. I promised it to the fans, I declared it many times, so I had to keep my word. So what was for me, you know, the, the prequel, so the, the something that happened before, it was not especially interesting for me. So I decided to make a side quell, like a branching of the branch, new branch on the old tree. So something in between. So of course, my laziness, the problem is my laziness, because of course I'm an avid reader of science fiction and fantasy and I realize how many books people from my competitors or colleagues can, are able to produce a year. So competing with them is very hard and very difficult. I, I still I wonder how, how it happened that I, that I managed. Well, of course, I'm talented. The talent is like, you know, like a big, big, big diamond in the big, big, big heap of potatoes. So you cannot overlook it. It looks, it does not look like a potato. That's for sure. <laughs>